After learning about equilibria and how to classify them, we're going to turn to parametrized dynamical systems, systems with constants or parameters that when you change them allow for changes in the dynamics. These changes are called bifurcations. Now, what does that mean? Well, we're going to have to unpack that. But if you look at dynamical systems where there are some constants, some parameters, some dial that you can turn, then what you see is depending on those constants, the behavior can change dramatically. Things that are stable can become unstable. Things can buckle or crash. Things can all of a sudden appear out of nowhere. And these changes in the qualitative behavior of a dynamical system are called bifurcations. Now, what bifurcations are going to mean for us in the context of this volume is the following. A bifurcation is a place in state and parameter space where there is a local change in the number or types of equilibria present. Now, that will take some unpacking. We'll look at some examples. But wait, there's more. Not only are we going to find particular bifurcations within certain dynamical systems, we're going to work towards classifying what types of bifurcations can happen. That is going to be really interesting. We're going to see patterns emerge where the same types of loss of stability or gain of stability can happen between different sorts of systems. In the end, what we're going to find is that big changes in dynamics can emerge from very, very small changes in constants, in parameters. And our investigations are going to lead us to develop a theory for such changes, bifurcation theory. This is going to greatly expand our view of what qualitative dynamical systems means.